Banwen. To cast our lots is an ancient fate, faith placed in footprints where they fall. Sarn Helen's course has seen soldiers exert, brothers endure, laden with their burden of belief. A will and a way wander here, a stone's throw from the roll of blue waters resounding. Delights, a people in voice, coil bren, on shloin, hen reed, names that sustain, hear he, Patrick, and Derelka, his sister, seized from the seams of blue, black, and spat across the sea, silenced ore to emerald isle. And Banwen, woman, legacies, lives ever present, keepers of hearth and home, seers through history's mist, pass through the needle's eye, threads drawn up in vigil and feast, a candle lit, a scoured floor, all luminous, and basins still warm, goblets brimming. Yet the dim pit's pitiless rock persists, now a hard vein, changed, still casts a latent shadow, its substrate of slavery, the bedrock of every shore, from Bronze Age to Covid Age, captive or free, the country holds its restless heritage. While coal dust disperses from lungs, how many breaths are held in a noxious lock? How many chip still at a rock when casting their lots? Patrick, our kin, our shared sisters, mothers, anonymous across the land, but Banwen stands in song, resounds. Her sweet notes erode the edges of the world.